All right, hey everybody, Evan here. Um, I was just editing some drone footage recently and I came across a quick adjustment that you can do uh, to your footage in Adobe Premiere Pro that can really um, add some color pop and make it stand out to other clips that you might see. So uh, I've got this clip that I shot just last weekend here um, off of the Mavic 2 Pro. And basically what we're going to be doing is applying an adjustment to your sky here um, and masking it so it does not affect your foreground. So we'll do that by creating a new adjustment layer. Drag that on top of the clip you want it to apply to. Um, and then over in your effects panel, I'm just gonna choose a really simple and easy brightness and contrast adjustment. So uh, if we go to adjust that brightness and contrast right now, as you can see, it applies to the entire frame. What we want it to do is just apply up here, not down here, so we get that crazy funky colors going on. So um, what you're gonna do is click this four point polygon mask. If you've got a pretty uh, simple horizon like I've got here. Um, I then like to scale my clip down quite a bit so I can actually have a little more freedom as to where I drag this mask to. Um, and what you want to do is take your points, drag them outside of your frame, because the next step after this, we get it approximately lined up with our sky, is to be adding a feather adjustment to it. So over here, you'll see this mask feather. It defaults to, I think, 10 pixels. Um, and I like to crank that sucker up. As you can see, you'll have some dotted lines that appear that show where that feather begins and where it ends. So right about there provides a fairly smooth transition between your sky and your foreground. Once that's applied, we'll scale it back up to fit. Now you can adjust your brightness and contrast as much as you want. You can go crazy depending on your personal preference, maybe not quite that far, <laughs> but uh, really bringing your brightness down, adding some contrast, almost as if you were shooting with a neutral density filter, um, which I actually don't have for my Mavic 2 Pro. So um, it's nice to be able to do this stuff in post with these really easy, quick adjustments. So there you can see it with the adjustment applied and there it is without. So again, just adding some good color pop to your clips, making that a little more cinematic and dynamic and standing out from the rest. So if you guys uh, have any questions or any ideas on tutorials you'd like to see in the future, or maybe stuff that you're learning right now and excited to share, um, leave it below in the comments. And again, I'll see you next time.